Yellow Jackets has been a huge hit this winter, but you'll be surprised to learn that the cast's personal lives are sometimes more intriguing than their characters. It's very intricate. Let's discover if Ella Purnell really dated Brad Pitt. Find out how music finally helped Juliette Lewis find her true love, and whose love story resembles a typical Hollywood romance. Let's start. Ella Purnell as Jackie. The Yellow Jacket's charismatic teen captain is played by the British actress Ella Purnell. Her most famous role is probably in the movie Miss Peregrine's Home for Peculiar Children. But you also might have seen her in the TV show Sweet Bitter and the zombie heist film Army of the Dead. Interestingly, the fact that she got the lead role on Sweet Bitter led to some disturbing rumors. Reportedly, Brad Pitt was so blown away by Ella's performances in her previous roles that he jumped at the opportunity to work with her. And when his company started developing Sweet Bitter, he allegedly influenced her casting. At the time, Purnell was 21 and Pitt was 53. The actor was already separated from Angelina Jolie. However, sources claim that she was furious about Brad's interest in Ella. All these speculations appeared to be false. Eventually, in 2019, Purnell started dating Rob Racco, best known for his stint on Riverdale. But fans are not sure if the two are still together because many of their pictures disappeared from Ella's Instagram. Moreover, last May, Batwoman star Ruby Rose posted a picture of Rob giving her a big kiss on the cheek. The caption to the photo was quite intriguing. Ruby wrote, Early morning coffee catch-up with one of my favorite people. Adore you, Rob Racco. Many were puzzled by the post and suggested that the two were an item. However, given the fact that Rose is openly gay, it seems much more likely that their affection is purely platonic. And if you take a closer look at Ella's and Rob's Instagram pages, you'll notice that they both still have some pretty adorable photos of them together. So, even if they are not dating anymore, at least they've parted on good terms. Now, let's see who's romance caused some controversy. Juliette Lewis as adult Natalie. The actress is quite a big name in Hollywood. She began acting at an early age and has had decades of on-screen credits. Juliet scored an Academy Award nomination for her role in Cape Fear and starred in the controversial crime film Natural Born Killers. More recently, she appeared in the series Wayward Pines and Secrets and Lies. Along with acting, Lewis is the front woman of the rock band Juliet and the Licks. In the 2000s, she married professional skateboarder Steve Barra, but the pair split amicably after four years together. Juliet found love again in 2016 when she went public with the Rage Against the Machine drummer Brad Wilk. However, their romance stirred up public opinion, as at the time, Wilk was still married with two children. His wife claimed that their marriage ended because of Brad's affair with Lewis. The actress and singer never commented on this. Still, she hinted at their blossoming relationship on Instagram. For instance, shortly after announcing that Wilk would join her band's European tour, she shared a post calling him her honey. Later, Juliet posted another snap of the two cuddling in bed, captioned, Love is real. Wilk also showed his affection for his new love by posting a selfie wearing a t-shirt with Lewis's face on. And although Juliet and Brad are now less open about their relationship, it seems like they are still together. For example, they showed up on the red carpet at the premiere of Adam Sandler's film Uncut Gems. Next, let's look at the actress who portrayed the younger Nat, Sophie Thatcher as teen Natalie. The 21-year-old Chicago native hasn't been acting for very long. So, Thatcher only has a few screen credits so far. They include movies like Prospect and TV series Chicago Med, and most recently, The Book of Boba Fett. Sophie absolutely loves being on Yellow Jackets, especially because she shares the role with the legendary Juliette Lewis. As for her love life, Thatcher appears to be single and dedicated to her career. At least, her online social media gives no indication that she has someone special at the moment. Still, you can follow her on Instagram to remain up to date with her professional endeavors. Now, let's talk about a cast member who found someone special after her first marriage failed. Tawny Cypress as adult Thaisa. The actress who plays the adult analog of Ty is a screen and stage veteran. She can be recognized from shows like House of Cards, The Blacklist, and Billions. Tawny has been married twice. She divorced her first husband four years after the wedding, despite having a son together. But her second marriage has been going strong since 2006. Cyprus and her husband Tom Dillon live in New Jersey. Tawny loves walking on the beach to clear her head and think things through. However, she and Tom now dream of buying a farm where they can keep chickens and alpacas. And what do we know about the actress who plays younger Ty? 
Jasmine Savoy Brown as Teen Thaisa. She's 27 and full of enthusiasm about playing a complicated character. The girls on Yellow Jackets really prove that there's so much in one person, shared Brown. Like her character on screen, Jasmine identifies as queer. She was in a relationship with actress Camille Killian from 2015 until recently. They met during the production of the drama series The Leftovers. Brown revealed that it was love at first sight. She recalled that she felt like the weight of the world fell off her shoulders. I knew I'd forever be okay because I now have this person in my life. It was magical. The two even moved in together. Unfortunately, it didn't last. It's not clear when and why exactly Brown and Killian broke up, but now Jasmine is in a relationship with actress Violet Bean. Some fans even think they are engaged, although the pair deny it. Well, maybe it's not true yet, but it seems like it might happen any day now. Next, let's see whose love story resembles a Hollywood romance and why. Melanie Linsky as adult Shauna The New Zealand native is a queen of independent films and is starting cult 1990s films like Heavenly Creatures. Most recently, you might have seen Melanie in Netflix's star-studded movie Don't Look Up. Amazingly, her love story closely resembles a Hollywood romance, complete with a workplace meet cute that led to her happily ever after. Linsky and Jason Ritter first met while filming the film The Big Ask and went on to star in two more movies together. They announced their engagement in 2017, after four years of dating, and less than two years later, the couple welcomed their first baby. Despite still not being officially married, they often call each other husband and wife. Just recently, Linsky shared a sweet snap of her cute husband on Instagram. And not surprisingly, he is a Yellow Jacket celebrity superfan. Now, it's time to move on to a cast member who's had a classic case of first date jitters. Sophie Nolis as Teen Shauna The high schooler is played by a 21-year-old Canadian actress. Interestingly, Sophie got into acting because of gymnastics, which was her passion from a very young age. She was even planning to enter in the Olympic Games. However, much to her own surprise, Sophie actually enjoyed acting more. She's appeared in a number of films, the most notable of which is The Book Thief. Nelise is currently in a relationship with the photographer Clovis Henrard. Hilariously, Sophie revealed that on their first date, she tripped over the stairs because she couldn't stop gazing at her now boyfriend. They first met in February 2020 and planned to take things slowly at first. However, the two ended up quarantining together, which drew them closer than they ever thought. Next, let's talk about an actress who was almost unrecognizable in her Yellow Jackets role. Christina Ricci as adult Misty Christina got her start in Hollywood at the age of nine. Her movie debut happened alongside Cher and Winona Ryder in Mermaids. Later, she appeared in more than 80 projects, including The Addams Family and Sleepy Hollow. In recent years, Ricci has been a part of TV shows like Grey's Anatomy and The Good Wife. Just like her credits, she also has a pretty long dating history. She was in a long-term relationship with fellow actor and producer Adam Goldberg. After they went their separate ways, Christina started dating Chris Evans. However, their fling didn't last long. After a couple of short-term relationships, Ricci met cinematographer James Hurtigan. The pair got married in 2013 and welcomed their son Freddie the following summer. The actress later recalled that marriage and motherhood changed her and seemed to be fully content with her life. But in 2020, Christina filed for divorce from James, citing irreconcilable differences. Moreover, she had to get an emergency protective order from her estranged husband. Fortunately, Ricci soon met the London-based hairstylist Mark Hampton, who became her second husband. Last October, the actress took to Instagram to share a loved-up snap from their wedding day. This announcement came just two months after Ricci revealed that she was going to become a mom of two. Life just keeps getting better, she shared, along with a close-up of an ultrasound of her baby. Their daughter was born in December 2021, and as the new mom revealed, her husband chose the infant's name without even consulting her. The star explained that they'd already decided to call her Cleo, but hadn't picked out the full name yet. However, while she was in recovery after the birth, Mark pronounced that the little one was called Cleopatra Ricci Hampton. Christina is definitely a doting mother, but she will still appear in the second season of Yellow Jackets, just like her younger counterpart. Samantha Hanratty as Teen Misty The 26-year-old is more commonly known as Sammy, as she's a former child actor who's been working since she was 10. Incredibly, Hanratty already has 60 acting credits to her name. You might have recognized her from the shows Salem and Shameless. But let's talk about her love life. And here's some awesome news. Samantha is engaged. 
Her boyfriend, Christian DeAnda, proposed to her last December, and Hanratty said yes. They've been together a little more than a year, and the relationship was pretty serious from the very start. Christian even moved to Canada to be with Sammy when she was cast in Yellow Jackets. And although she can't wait to marry her boo, for the time being, Hanratty's just enjoying every moment of being his fiance. So, we'll keep an eye on this cute couple and let you know when the wedding bells ring. Now, let's finally get to the actress who plays one of the most important characters on Yellow Jackets. Courtney Eaton as Lottie. She started modeling and taking acting classes at the age of 16 as part of her professional development. And to her own surprise, Courtney landed a role on the massive production Mad Max Fury Road. Next, she joined the cast of the fantasy action film Gods of Egypt alongside Gerard Butler and Nikolai Koster Waldau. Her most recent role before Yellow Jackets was the main character in the action crime thriller Line of Duty. Courtney prefers to keep the details of her love life to herself, but it's quite hard when you are an actress and your boyfriend is singer-songwriter Ross Lynch. The couple began dating in 2015 and were together for two years. Even after their breakup, Courtney and Ross starred together in the movie Status Update, so we can assume their split was amicable. Since 2018, the actress has been in a relationship with the cinematographer and camera operator Spencer Goodall. Last June, the two celebrated three years together, and as Courtney joked, they're still not tired of each other. That is all about the ladies on Yellow Jackets. Let us know if you want to know more about the cast of this show. Thanks for watching and stay awesome!